other time in our history have justice and fairness been sorely wanting. And what better way to demonstrate this than deciding upon the fate of four people, two men and two women, found guilty beyond reasonable doubt by our court and sentenced to death by hanging. How can a law be just and right if we seek and put to that four people who had been through a lot? Since when did morality become the foundation of our legal order? But a sentence in any criminal proceedings is never just if attending circumstances are decidedly left out in the equation of how our legal and justice systems have become farcical, a source of mockery and travesty that favors the rich and the powerful. It's time for the president to decide.